The picture I'm about to show you is jaw dropping. Allow me to explain. You can see right here, this is a picture of your brain. Now, what specifically is this a picture of? This is a picture of your blood flow to your brain. This includes all the arteries and all the capillaries. Now, the capillaries are the very smallest delivery system of blood to your brain. Some of these capillaries are literally the size of one red blood cell. So now imagine if you have thick blood, if you're inflamed and you have thick blood, you are not going to get the proper blood flow, the proper oxygenation to your your brain. This is why it's very, very critical to know these three top labs to see if you are inflamed. Because if you're inflamed, your blood is thick. If your blood is thick, guess what's happening to nutrients, oxygen going up to your brain. It's not going to be as optimal if you weren't inflamed. So these are the three labs you're going to want to know. One is CRP. This is a global inflammatory marker. This should be less than one. Number two, fibrinogen. Fibrinogen is a marker of basically fibers in your blood that will cause your blood cells to clot. I like to see this marker between three and 400 on labs. And the fourth thing is, is what we call homocysteine. Homocysteine is another inflammatory marker in particular to your brain. Now I like to see this marker around five or six. So these are the three key markers that you want to get checked to see if you possibly have thick blood causing your brain fog or brain fatigue, or for that matter, any future problems when it comes to your brain. If you like this content, please like, comment, and share this with a loved one.